Hello and welcome to Gavin's 1,000 subscriber special hosted race. Very excited. Um, just the second ever hosted race he's done. Uh, we had the uh, first one. I got that uploaded on the uh, on my channel as well. Uh, congrats to him, of course, for 1,000 subscribers. That's an awesome milestone. And uh, I am a proud subscriber. <laughs> I always enjoy watching his videos. We're at Gateway uh, in the Arca car. Um, and I think if that's everything, all the housekeeping I got to think of, um, thanks to him for hosting. We got Nick in here, we got all the viewers, <laughs> full house. I'm, I bet all 1,000 subscribers would show up if they could. <laughs> but, uh, you have about one lap of fuel I don't know, it's, uh, it's 100 laps, gateways, both Gavin and my Hulk track, actually. Uh, both from the St. Louis area, so that's pretty cool. Uh, got some really fast guys in here, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to repeat my performance from the last Osage race, but uh, hopefully get a nice solid finish regardless, and remember it's uh, all for fun anyway too, so I don't want to run anyone over by accident. Oh my god, start that over, I no one saw that. <laughs> Trying to get a run off the corner and I was sliding a bit. Hello and welcome. No, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> uh, just gonna get a better run this time. We have enough time. So, there is a good potential for green flag pit stops. We had a completely green race last time, which was awesome. Uh, this is a little bit more likely of a track to end up with some cautions. Nashville Super Speedway is kind of paranormal and prevents cautions, <laughs> but. Uh, you know, we might get some this time, and that's okay. We got lots of different people, different uh, skill levels, and you know, everyone's gonna be doing their best. Oh my! What on earth is wrong with me? This is. I gotta get a lap in. Let me. <laughs> Jesus. Hello and welcome. <laughs> what a tragedy! The start already is awful. Okay, are we gonna have enough time? Like. Can I get a lap in, please? I guess I need to focus. <laughs> I swear I'm taking it exactly how I did. I did lots of practice. Um, to make sure I knew what I was doing before heading in, but... I don't know. Maybe, uh... It's getting slippery? Sun's going down? I don't know. Green flag, green flag. Jesus. Well, you'd okay. think I didn't do any practice at all. Okay. Well, I guess make sure we take this first lap a little bit easier, so I don't die. Ugh. Well, I guess that wasn't that bad. <laughs> that feels different. It might be in my head. I might be making excuses. But it feels different to me. Like a temperature change or something happened. But. Different amounts of rubber on the track. Oh, uh, that's that's a halfway decent lap. I'm okay with that. Let's see if we can do any better. D6. You've just done a that's okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't feel like I nailed that, and yet I'm got, I'm getting a better time. So there's like some more grip on the track or something going on here. It's gonna be about the same, I think. Two six six, two two five. Quickly before the race starts, uh, thank you all so much for coming and supporting. It's freaking amazing! I can't believe it. Um, I just I never expected it, and it looks like we're gonna have a full field in the race. So that's gonna be crazy. Um, quick reminder: single file restarts, cautions on, no fast repairs. So keep that in mind. And try and take care of your tires if you can. You got a hundred laps, only one change. That shouldn't be a problem. I, I didn't think it was going to be a problem, but something to, something to keep in mind. Thanks again. Oh, and I'm going to have chat muted for the lap until I get the green to do the intro and stuff. But after that, it'll be back on. Thanks, Gavin. I actually had this on our family calendar to block it out so my wife would know I, I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, thanks, man. Been looking forward to it That's all. That's the end of the session. P5. Congratulations, too. I have co-workers actually watching because I wouldn't shut up about it during the week. <laughs> One left to green. You'll be lining up on the inside. Putting the pressure on. <laughs> Good luck. I'm just super nice guys in here. Ah, uh, no, it's okay. I, I get to do the reviews either way, so, you know. So I just wanted to let Gavin talk and let everyone else kind of talk a little bit and not want to have to talk over him. So, very exciting event. Oh, uh, gosh. I don't want to wreck anyone. I'm going to be very careful and I want to be easy on the tires. Uh, I don't think I'm repeating my performance. We've got guys running laps like that. So I know Patrick Jones is very fast. I've seen him in races before. So, I, I mean, several of these guys up here definitely are going to be the ones to beat, and uh, I don't think I really have a good game plan on tire saving. I've just got my... Uh, everybody, have fun. Oops. Well, good reminder. And my brakes all the way back, including in the car. You too, man. And uh, maybe I think... Uh, I I think uh, where I can get a lot of speed on these guys... I don't know the backstory, but I like it. ...will be consistency, hopefully. Maybe gain some time just, with pitting. Uh, I did a like lot of practice with pit entry and exit. So hopefully I can get that done well. I think you can gain a lot of time on pit entry, but obviously you can also wreck yourself on pit entry. Because <laughs> you have to take that access road here. It's pretty crazy. So I, I did a lot of practice with that. Hopefully I can make up some time. I don't know. Uh, I'm just going to try to remember not to drive over my head and run into anyone. Remember to just have a fun time because it's, uh, you know, it's, it's just uh, just for fun, just to celebrate 1,000 hey, subscribers for Gavin. Up. I haven't been here, uh, these big girls, so uh, I'm going to take it easy for a couple laps. Plus, I have gas in front of me, so. <laughs> it's like first gear start, perhaps. And leave some space. Uh, I think the second gear might have been the way to go. Oh, well. Now I know. You have about one lap of fuel left outside. Still there, hold your line. That's a glitch. I don't have one lap of fuel left, I promise. Still there, hold your line. We are side by side at the moment. Keep low. Keep low. Ooh, Clear I hope I didn't push him up into the wall. Thought I gave room, I hope I did. I'm going to be using third gear in turns one and two. I like the way that feels, and I believe it is the fast way around. I'm glad I got that practice at uh, Milwaukee Mile. Because I did some shifting there as well. It's so funny that uh, coincidentally we're heading to a place that shifting is also important. Right afterward. Alright, just riding. We obviously have a lot of laps to do. Don't think I'm going to be trying to make any passes or anything for a while. Try to get the braking done with the, uh, or the turning rather, done with the brake pedal instead of the wheel. Uh, 16.1 was a little bit too, um, unresponsive. I mean, oh no, the first hosted yellow flag for Gavin. Oh my god, it's real. What is that yellow thing on the corner? Where's Jim? He needs to donate to charity. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry, no pity money tonight. Oh, man. What happened? How long can we go on fuel? <laughs> it was 70 laps uh, under green, but now there's a caution, so you're going to get a few more. 
Ten, but, uh, yeah, eight, sorry about guys. that. <laughs> sorry about what? What happened? Did you kill the car, Gavin? Gavin wrecked? No. I just self spun. Oh, no! It's just gonna be more impressive when you go through the field, right? The host wrecks. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. He just wanted to save his viewers from being the, the ones who came and uh, brought up the caution first. <laughs> How very kind of him. Hey, it's better than crashing a plane on purpose for views. <laughs> Alright, so. Pretty good start. I'm happy with how this started. Uh, we got into a nice single file line. Everyone seems to be patient. Doing well. I mean, you'd kind of expect everyone to be patient types if they enjoy watching Gavin's videos. Uh, I imagine they probably share a similar driving style and more like most likely anyway, you know, um, of patient driving and not just the type to dive in. Yeah, uh, I'm not that good. <laughs> I was like, what, what are you doing? And somehow I got through the gears past me and like, oh, he left that auto blip. Yeah, I'm going to go second gear this time. I, I shifted way too early from first to second anyway to start with. And there you start, because we reached uh, we reached the limiter too quick on first gear. Second gear start this time. Oh, single file, that's right. Forgot. So to help... Uh, I'll prevent. If we do get a green flag stop, uh, don't forget you need to use that access road to get on pit road. If I can keep myself from self spinning again later in the race. <laughs> it's just a competition caution if you're there, wasn't it? Yeah, competition caution. Yeah, tire test. Single file, I like it. I enjoy single file restarts. So he did that to help uh, prevent any. Uh, just any uh, extra chance of caution fest, you know, if it starts getting bad. Starting against go <laughs> yeah. I like single file. I think it's uh, it's very nice. Hopefully, uh, second gear is the right way, and I didn't just mess up first gear. It's kind of weirdly in between. Sure, catch up. Hide carries off. Green, green, green. All right, a pretty good jump. Well, I drove a little bit. It was hard to judge how fast I was heading into uh, turn one since we just restarted. Still not going to be uh, looking to make any passes or anything right now. I'm going to be looking to save tire. We got a group of like, we got a nice group up here that I think all could potentially have enough speed to win. Very good competitors. So, uh, it's going to be about getting that extra edge somehow. Tire saving is going to be one way to do it. A little shallow there I was. Throwing in a little bit higher in three and four. That I wonder if that might be a little better on the tire. I don't know. I, I feel like I'm not turning the wheel at all, so I shouldn't be too bad. So I'm just braking uh, to get the car turned. Ooh, that guy got close to my rear end. To uh, try not to overdrive it on center. I'm a little loose, we're good. 
Uh, a little bit too hard there. Everyone's super close together. Now we'll just in a single file line here. It's uh, racing for the long term. Sorry, John. One's ready. To go long distance. gonna lift off. The only way I'm gonna try to pass this point at this point is if uh, I get just a too big a run to not take it. If guy gets loose or something, that's about the only time I'm gonna be trying anything right now. Maybe if the uh, 18 in front of us starts falling off or something, I won't want to start losing time, you know. So I don't think that's gonna happen though. He's fast. Of course, uh, I mean, I'm just as liable to to uh, ruin my tires unintentionally. So, you can see me, see it happening to me. Slow through center there. That lap time was 35.2. Laps are a little faster here, I believe, than Nashville Super Speedway, so maybe these 100 laps will take off a little faster than one might expect. After 77 laps at the uh, at Nashville. Okay, counter steer. Hitting the <laughs> limiter there. That's uh, just how this is set up. I think it almost has to be set up that way just because of how different the corners are. You might have to think about getting a run here. On the 18. I don't want to start a move I'm not going to be able to finish. Fighting side by side is uh, not going to do either of us any good. I'll try not to be too eager. We're going for it. Stay low. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear high. Okay, got that done. Good stuff, in the top five. Get back in fear. Can't wait till I find out how hard I overdrove it later. Oh, actually, the 14 followed us through, too. Seeing a little bit of separation here. That's why I'm trying to go now a little bit more. Mm, I don't want to take this yet. I think it might be dangerous trying to pass into turns one and two. Okay, Colton. Keep it up. Tried to get the run, but uh, got too hard on the gas. Gotta set it up, I think. Mm -hmm. Now we are getting past, and I got held up there. Still inside. Still there, inside. Clear. Father side by side. 
Maybe 14 can get it done. I'm just thinking about how I don't want to wreck another person today, honestly. Yeah, I think that Gavin was in that race too, so it's gonna it's gonna be on recording. Me wrecking someone. I mean aside from my own recording. That's uh it's time for pitting. About now. Mm, mm, mm. I still don't think that's enough to make it on fuel. Wait, I forgot there's only one set of tires. Yeah, we can't take that yet, can we? Oh, that's tough. That's a tough call. Nah, we can't go in yet. That's way too early. Fills up to five. Yeah, I can't. Not yet. Not yet. Dustin, I hate to be the guy, but you are blanking on beer. Ten four. Ten four. We got someone hidden in the pits. They're going for it. I'm on pit because I'm just logging laps. Oh. Doesn't seem like we have any wheel spin. I know the tires actually aren't too bad. The tire wear isn't too bad. Not as much as you might think. So I feel okay. Checking out front stretch. Staying out here. So we're sixth. I think that's where we started. <laughs> we've we've moved ahead a little bit, moved behind a little bit. Um, I've been really trying to focus on uh, getting the rotation from nice breaking. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass. Don't yeah, I don't want to touch it for sure. Oh, we got lucky dogs. Okay. I don't know why we wouldn't, but. <laughs> Let them on by on the outside. I imagine they should be coming by any time now. Does the front of my car look all good, Kevin? Hope uh, Justin's doing okay. Uh, Wasn't in any wrecks. He's actually right next to Nick there. It's the one in the Discord, right? Justin Schuler. I like watching his videos as well. I'm behind you. Oh. Oh. What's happening? Yeah, it looks really good. I like it a lot. The, yeah, I, I saw it in practice. It looks really good. Mm -hmm. I mean, damage, but the thing. <laughs> so, yeah, you're. Yeah, yeah, it's not damaged. So, Nick made some uh, yeah, paint right schemes. Like Dr. Pepper George, paint George, schemes and stuff. And I've got one on for this special occasion. Uh, Dr. Pepper, or Diet Dr. Pepper slash Wendy's. Um, yeah. In his Q&A, he talked too. about enjoying Wendy's food because that I was the question I asked about for your fast food choice. Not a visual person, so it was really <laughs> so difficult for me. I assume that's why Nick yeah, made a, am, one of the schemes he made. Good, but I just do simple shapes. One of the schemes he made with Wendy's and, uh, of course, one. Gavin's iconic Diet Dr. Pepper. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I, um, so uh, I ran it. Uh, I thought everybody was going to be running them, so, but like, now I kind of feel like I... Not thinking about stuff and went to the Halloween party in costume and no one else did. <laughs> but, uh, oh, yeah, it's a good that. scheme, so I'm okay with it. Except uh, picking a wife, that's what I always say. My cheddar scheme will be back soon. Yeah. But, uh, Nick's really good with paint schemes. So, uh, he's got a trading paints uh, profile now where he's been uploading some stuff, and they're really good. So if you're looking for some uh, shiny new colors, good place to look. <laughs> One left to green. Race cars in this lap. So the idea is that, well, we're not going to make it on. F we weren't going to make it on yeah, fuel. Yeah, you're going to go to the Cup Series race when they come here this year. If we build it up, so. I'm gonna try. I've looked at tickets. Um, I'm not sure exactly, like where I'm gonna sit, but I'm definitely gonna try and go. I'd love to be able to go. It's pretty expensive yeah, though. Yeah, it's a really I'm cool sure. track. I'm happy they added it to the schedule. 
I've been to Gateway once for a trip. Oh, yeah, race, well, I it was. Be. Kind of before, I was like a little too young to fully appreciate it, though, I think. <laughs> I get a lot more out of it now, I think. That's uh, about ready to get going. Been a great race so far. A couple of cautions, but got some green flag uh, run runs in between them. Green flag, green flag. Good jump uh, on the 18 behind us. Sixth place. Being patient. Guys have cooled down a little bit, so. To be aware of that change. This uh, breaking zone kind of scares me, I'll be honest. Uh, if you get to me, I'll give it to you, bud. I'm just worried I'm going to run into the back of someone. I kind of felt like maybe I was a little tight there. That was interesting. To the center of the corner. Maybe I overdrove it a bit. That I definitely overdrove. Mm, not enough. Have a run. We don't want to take that. Ooh. A bit of a check up here. Sorry, I held the brake and went down anyway. Caution. Oh no! Single file. Close. Cautions now. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Pace car is out. Line up single file. Hmm. Find car number fourteen nine point three gallons. Now, can we make it on fuel? <laughs> Nine, yeah, that's a lot to save, though. Seven point five. Nine point one. I think we might be able to save. <sighs> we gotta go in. We're going in. Letter fourteen, car by. Watch your speed limit in the pits. The pit lane speed limit is forty five miles per hour. So here's the plan. We think we'll need to stop. No tires. But we will fill it up. Right. Box in five, four, three, two, one. Box now. No tires. Fill it up with fuel. That's it. So that way, if it does go green to the end, we can make it. We don't want to be the ones. We don't want to be left out. If we can't make it, and someone else can. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. So we're gonna be in fuel save mode for a while now. Two point three gallons. So it says two point three gallons we need to save. However, I have my crew chief set to give me a little bit extra, and I do I know? I'm pretty sure there's not green white checkers. So we don't have to worry about having that little bit of extra there at the end. We'll have enough fuel if... The cut right here in, in past years? Full course yellow. Pits are open. That's a negative. Mm -hmm. Xfinity and truck so, uh, the only two series. 2.1 gallons. 
Oh, retires 95 and 96. Uh, okay, so I'm glad I did not take them. Was great with Grosjean just going hard. Now I really got to be careful because I can't run over the guys in front of me. Yeah, I watched that race. That was pretty amazing. I have to be very patient. Two point one gallons. I think I can save enough fuel. The way I'm going to have to do it, though, is no more third gear. Two point two. No more third gear, so that should save a little bit. Let off a little earlier, maybe. And then if this goes green to the end, I like where we are. That's my uh, my shot. I don't think I had a chance of beating the fastest guys up there unless I do something with strategy. And, uh, I mean, a race like this, it's open. you know, your goals are have fun. <laughs> don't ruin any, anyone else's fun. And, uh, so you're a Gordon fan, where you Gavin? I'm not sure. See if you can win the thing. Yeah. All right, Colton, get ready. Race the regime at the end of yeah, the Yeah, that's what a lot of people say. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. 1.9 gallons. He's my guy. That's, uh, that's all I gotta say. Mm -hmm. I just thought about the fuel situation. Yeah, I, I realized that it's calculating guy, so. based on a lot of these slower laps we're doing. Yeah, I like him too. Like the, him and Earnhardt and Earnhardt Jr. They're all my favorites. And I mean, I don't know. But I kind of grew up after the, the whole rivalry, rivalry with him first joining and everything. Yeah, I was in college then, so I remember it well. Yeah. Well, we are pretty far back with this uh, single file stuff. What's going on here? What's going on, boy? No idea what that was. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. Eh? Hey. Car outside. Still there. I want to get past that guy. Outside, clear. Go ahead, Chuck. He's having some issues. Car inside. Yeah. Clear. Trying to be aggressive here. <laughs> inside. Clear inside. Car inside. Keep high. I better get a good review on that. Clear inside. B26. Just, uh... Just, uh... Car outside. Yeah. Clear All right. outside. Need the pass. Nice. Just gotta be patient. Make our way up through. Two gallons. That's right, I gotta remember, uh, fourth gear. Just in case. Gotta remember my fuel plan. Hard to remember whenever you gotta make your way through the field a little bit, but. B25. The lap time was at 35.2. Sent it pretty good. Alright. Ooh, good guys. save, 24. Something going on ahead. Outside. The gap behind is now 1.2 seconds. Stay low. Keep low. Clear up top. Car outside. Go low. Still there. Alright, I'm real serious. I know I'm quiet. 
I'm real serious about not running. Still there, hold your line. I'm gonna have nightmares about the guy I wrecked at Indianapolis be open. <laughs> so. Still there. So we got the guy on the outside, they're uh, shifting. So that's gonna make it harder to Clear out get past him. I gotta get used to driving this thing in fourth gear because I haven't been doing it. <laughs> I've been doing uh, third gear. Backing off. Cool. Thank you. And it is kind of nice to be able to put the throttle down on exit without it going crazy. <laughs> I think uh, number 38 might be on a similar strategy. He came into the pits earlier, so I'm not sure what his strategy is. I think he thinks he can make it to the end on fuel as well. 1.7. So we are saving, it sounds like. Nice job, the sky bomb goes good. I do worry that uh, this might be harsher on the tires, not doing third gear. Car outside. I'm gonna have to make sure I don't uh, do anything too crazy with the uh, part tight. Clear outside if you want to. What is going on there? I got ten minutes more repairs to Gavin. I'm gonna sign off. Thanks for it. It was a lot of fun. Sorry, 28. I got into you. I held the brake and split anyway. Oh. Eight yeah, thanks for coming. Sorry you got a wreck. Oh, it happens, but hopefully you can be in the next one. What do we do here? What? Is another one? Oh, yeah, totally. Just on out. me, so I'm just more embarrassed file. than anything. <laughs> Alright, take care, guys. Have a good one. It's closed. See you, well. Huh. 1.6 gallons. What? I don't know what to do. This is a weird time. Like, that, this wasn't uh, what I was hoping for, for the tire strategy. Obviously, so. Hmm. Too, still too early for tires, maybe? Catch that, 38, car, catch that, 400, 6, car. Leader, Jones, the tires will uh, make sure. 1.7 gallons. I don't want to be in front of the field, you know what I mean? With old tires. I don't know if I want to use my fires. We'll fuel you to the end of the race. Is this guy... Box in a five, four, three, two, one. Box now. Gas and go. We're done. Get going. We don't have to worry about it anymore, and I'm not at the very front of the field. <laughs> a little tight over here. Oh. Oh. Mm. We're tires. Ninety-two, ninety-four. Still better than. Yeah, so I didn't take tires, and some other people didn't, so just be careful out there. Ninety-two, ninety-five. Let's go to the end. Ninety-two, ninety-four. Okay. 
of course yellow. Pits are open. Yeah, apparently I'm not pushing it. 96, 98. Ooh, I wish I had that. 92, 93, so... 94, 94. He's got it figured out. <laughs> 92, 94. I feel like uh, I could have been a little better off, maybe, if... Uh, 90, 95? Shifting that run. Maybe the 94 is a 93, and the 92 is a 93, you know what I mean? Did Nick fit? Hmm. Yeah, but I think he took two tires or no tires or something. He got out quick. Man, I'm so far I'll behind. Let him know. I took no tires. tires and I'm still back behind you. It must have been a couple two tire stops. For the guys behind me, I am on old tires still, so if there's a speed difference, that's why. You got plenty of fuel. I just feel like uh, we're going to want these tires later if uh, we get another caution, and it seems like we're getting pretty regularly scheduled. Uh, I'm just still going to the front. Well, I don't know. I don't know what uh, how much the tires make a difference. I don't. I don't think I've ever run Arca here. So. One to go. Next time by. We're going green. Next time by. <sighs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Just about to approach halfway, that's why I feel like not quite time for tires, because if we get a caution late, then I'm going to be zooming on the freshies. And that's the edge I'm going to need if I'm going to beat out some of the guys. We have some guys that just stayed out, I believe. It does look like there's some, about maybe one or two green. names up there. That's interesting. Got to remember that uh, we're still going to be all the way back here <laughs> when it's time to go. In effect, jump for that. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green flag. Green Hard to flag. see where I needed to see either. But, uh, okay, well enough. Went well enough. I mean. loose. Got to get used to how it feels again <laughs> to be in third gear. Got to get back into the groove. Some space behind us. That's good. Shuffling going on up there, that's a little bit scary. Hey, we got a fellow uh, <laughs> Dr. Pepper Wendy's. I knew there would be others. Car outside. Still there. Still there. Ooh. Still there, hold your line. Outside, clear. You're in the top ten. And that was a little scary there for a second. Whew. I think Nick's coming. I have to watch out for him. He's probably yeah, got either two or four tires. really bunched up up there. I'm not gonna fight you, Patrick. That's scary. 
<laughs> that was really bad, Luce. I'm gonna take it easier. You have a thing. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for the patience there, Jeff. There's Appreciate a lot it. of shuffling up here. Yeah, are people going to go for, for the content, or would it be nice? Have we got enough caution? Swings four, you making a move? Sorry. We're pushing up a bit, okay. Oh, he got loose off the corner. Five's still here, though. Um, we got pressure from behind, for sure. Place. Oh, man. We got three white coming up. That looked like it was heading that direction for a second. Car outside. Not mean to dive by like that, but he was through there much slower. Spad, 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 that was really sketchy. I tried to pull. Oh man, that got scary for a minute. Thanks, though, you too. Eric, were we three wide through that there, Heidi? Yeah, I think so. I thought an airplane crash was incoming. Open. You're good, man. I, there was so much going on, I don't even think I noticed. Yeah, that was uh, that was really. Uh, he says that was hairy, but I think it's more likely my hair's falling out. Twenty four. Oh, he's gone, Vince. Okay, I was like, what? Where? Okay. Yeah, still a little too early to get our tires for it to be a big enough advantage. Um, yeah, James, I got such a good run out to. Um, I had nowhere else to go but to take it three wide. Oh. oh man, you're good. I was on old tires, and I probably made a bad challenge to the inside of David and wanted to. That's part of why we got stacked up. So you're good, man. Fuck you, dog high. It's fun racing, out for sure. I, I thought for sure we were going to crash, but everyone kind of held it. Um, we got uh, three guys under a blanket there for a moment, and I was stuck in the middle, and I just had to keep it steady. But, uh, we've made our way forward, even on our old tires, just a little bit, but... Uh, I do feel uh, the car's suffering a bit. Oh, no. <laughs> Lucky like dog kind of just yeah. pushing his way through. And I had to, the guy was sitting there. Uh, I think we get one more run, one more decent run, and then maybe I take my tires at that point. Might have to be what I do. So we are baking out another caution. And uh, like I said, I, I think. Uh, People are racing hard enough. 
could be a thing. So, like I said, I think it's gonna have to be strategy that gets us a chance. Pit road is closed right now. So those guys up there are just super fast. So I'm gonna need some sort of advantage to get get past them, and I think it's gonna be tires. I don't know who and who hasn't taken their tires yet up there. I know uh, number 14 James said that he had not taken tires yet. So he's got another set presumably. I don't think he took them early or anything. I have to imagine some of the guys up here took some tires at some point. Spin, we're good. Low enough RPMs that uh, on the second gear start that we're not going to be spinning tires, I don't think, at any point. Especially because the tires really aren't wearing all that hard. I've pushed them pretty hard that run. They're probably still, at the worst, in the high 80s, you know, mid-high 80s. That's probably the worst it would ever be. I don't even think it's that bad, so. <sighs> we haven't killed anyone yet. Okay, Colton. Get ready. Race the regime at the end of this lap. I don't think I made any overly aggressive moves either. I know I kind of dove in on one guy once, but it's just because I think we have different lines. I kind of take it a little more uh, more direct <laughs> into turn one. And uh, I know I got to be ready to stick it down low, keep it down low when they're on the outside. So. And I think a lot of guys are running that middle lane, so it was more like I picked the bottom lane rather than diving in, I think, or I hope so. I always look at the footage afterwards and say, like, oh, you know what, that was pretty aggressive, that probably was unnecessary. I'll, uh, I'll think about that afterward. So. I think we're doing alright. We're starting to get up into the names that uh, each of the, these guys have a chance to win. They're all pretty fast, so. I mean, obviously. These aren't the only guys that can have a chance to win, but I know these guys are all super fast up here. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green, green, green. Thought the leader going, but they couldn't see him, so... Understandable they didn't get the same job. Patient on this throttle. Throttle. Go, go, go. Man, this, uh... Don't have a good run. Sorry, uh, this is intense. This is intense racing. <laughs> um, I don't... I hate being right on the back of someone, because I always feel like I'm just going to rear-end them so bad. really don't want to do that. Thank you, David. Yep. What's going on up there? <laughs> Got shuffling. Spot shuffling. I got it on a little early there, but I think I'm fine. Ooh. I feel like I brain food that corner. Or that, uh... Pull straight away. That's probably not good. Got too low there. Give him the lane. Mess that up. Keep low. Still there. Hold your line. Clear up top. Outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Go ahead, Gavin. Keep low. Well, those are the perks to be in the hole, Dave. <laughs> Stay low. Bottom line's not working for me. Clear. It's moved off, head in here. The tires are starting to hurt, that's for sure.
definitely feel it. We're gonna need that other caution. I don't think that bottom line is going to work for me in turns one and two anymore. Car doesn't have enough grip anymore. That stuff. Interesting. Go a little wide there. We made it work, we got the run off. But for a second Nick was gonna have the nose on me on exit. I'm gonna I hope I don't end up doing this whole darn race on one set of tires. Would not be uh, my ideal plan. But uh, I feel like I'm, I'm going to have trouble moving forward anymore. Go ahead, 37. I'll give it to you in one. Step four. Car inside. Oh, Wild Gavin appears. Where did he come from? Where on earth did he... I swear he came out of nowhere. Holy cow. <laughs> One second it was Nick. Next time it was Gavin. Well, I better watch out for him. Apparently he has good tires or something. Or good skill. Or both. He has both, I bet. There he goes. Give it to him. Stay high, put your car on the low side. Still there. Clear. Car inside. Still there, inside. And we got guys following through. Still Looks like we're falling back now. Clear. Well, at least we haven't hit the wall or anything like that. Famous last words. Man, this is a struggle, though. Next track, this, uh, next, uh, caution, rather. It's gonna be time for tires. Can't continue on these very much longer. The way they're feeling. Whew, that Lewis, I probably scared Nick there. We got it, we're under control. Kind of. I mean, we're keeping up decently well. It's just, uh, it's definitely a lot harder on me to be uh, hitting these times. The car's not behaving quite the same anymore. I'd even say it's misbehaving. Saw some sparks there, someone must have scraped the wall. These are uh, starting to get used to how these tires are feeling, so not quite as uh, scary. I can be more consistent, maybe. 
don't think there's any way I'm passing her. I kind of just have to drive defensively and probably get on Nick's every last nerve. Fighting, uh, fighting him off on exit. If we don't get a caution, we're going to have a pretty mediocre finish. Your lap time was 35.6. Cup times are pretty consistent. Kind of had a little bit of a checkup mid corner there. Wheels probably making a bunch of noise. I'm sorry. <laughs> I feel like my commentary is probably not even all that good because uh, I barely even know what I'm saying. I'm just so focused right now. Outside. Go low. We got uh, tight in the corner. Still there. Hold your line. Outside. Clear. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Still there. To make sure I was going to be able to stick it down here. Still there. Uh, I can't quite clear him. Woo! Got that pass done. Overdrove that. I'm gonna have to use third gear this corner. I don't like using third gear here, but I overdrove that so bad I needed to do it there. <sighs> okay, gotta hit my mark better than that next time. We got the uh, top 10 all in front of us there. Really have to slow down to make the corners now. I like to get on the brake hard. Hmm. Hmm. This uh, that lap time was brake bias is the only reason I'm able to survive right now. Break by setting all the way to the rear. That's the only reason. Got loose there. Unfortunately. Fought through it a little bit though. We got him on the apron. I'll give you a load here, Joe. Shoot. Thank you. We gotta be more patient on throttle. Yes, sir. Mm. Not what I wanted. I'm gonna have to let Nick by. He's faster than us at this point. Inside. Still there. Clear inside. <sighs> Minimize uh, the damage, don't get freight trained at least. Now Nick usually lifts a little bit earlier, so I wanted to make sure I didn't run in the back from there. It's good to know. Pre racing sometimes. Help you prepare for things. Tires are bad at this point. I'm gonna need a caution soon for my strategy to play out. Uh... He's probably on original tires too, and I'm just so bad at saving tires. <laughs> it's hard to know for sure what's going on. <laughs> Man, my hands are hurting, but it's so I'm having great fun. This is great.
little behind the corner. That's how I'm going to get him run off, though. Maybe I should be a little higher up in the corner like that. Not sure. Hey, lap 77. Congrats again to Gavin. Remember, he's the reason we're here. <laughs> 1,000 subscribers. This is your lap 77 shout out to Gavin. <laughs> Make that a thing. I'll never remember that. There's no way. I barely do races that have 77 laps to begin with. Definitely not going to remember to do that. <laughs> Whenever we, uh, when it does happen. I'm almost having to dine in the corner at this point. My tires are so evil. A little space behind us. Not much. the uh, caution at this point to get a top 10 if I think that's going to be a thing. Figured something out that, that lap. About a tenth and a half up. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Got yeah, uh, squirrels. <laughs> Not that they're squirrely, they're just swerving. <laughs> Not sure what happened. Saved it though, whatever did happen. Mm. Oh wow, we got a whole second behind us now. What happened? Did they start wrecking? I reckon. You've just done a 35 point tight. Thanks, George. This lower line is. A loose race car is what it has. I'm not faster than Nick, so I'm not going to try to pass him right away. I think he just got caught up by these uh, guys for a second. So much counter steer needed at this point on the exit to prevent it from killing me. Not what I wanted. <laughs> Getting loose. Oh, hey! Justin's back there. He's gonna pass me before this thing's over, maybe. He's usually pretty good at saving tires. Hey, Roach, go ahead. He might have the, uh, the secret combination. <laughs> I think everyone up here is tearing him off. Fighting it so hard, this thing is going crazy. This uh, this final corner here really does remind me of the Milwaukee Mile. Using the uh, brake on entry to get it to turn and stuff. That was a thirty-five point nine. Getting late on the track. Sun's going down. Race started at uh, late afternoon, I think. Now it's starting to come nighttime. Lights are on and stuff. Oh, that's not. <laughs> Outside. 
Stay low. Clear up top, outside. The next car is... Keep right. low. Clear outside if you want it. I messed that up. Car outside. Clear. Car outside. Clear outside if you want it. I feel like I'm a big major pest in this race right now. Like I, I'm fighting back for every spot, but it feels like uh, I feel like I can do there. It's just I make a mistake, you know, and then suddenly I'm not there anymore. It's just so hard to hit these marks that I need to be hitting. I almost feel like it's uh, pretty much out of time. For the tires to matter enough. Strategy was not a good one on a link. So, we penalized ourselves and ran, are gonna run the whole darn race on one set of tires. <sighs> Man, I'm sweating though. <laughs> Intense racing. You know, it's, no one's been talking for a long time. I feel like it's because everybody's racing so hard. Okay, Colton, we're gaining on the car in front. The gap's now 0.6. Uh, that off the here. might matter enough if we get it right away. Thank you. Uh, it's gonna be. I'll give you the bottom. Wonder if Nick's mad at me for how hard I'm driving into the corners. <laughs> I'm driving into the corners really hard. Be fair. Not gonna hit him. I trust myself enough not to run into him, but he probably doesn't. <laughs> got movement up there. I wonder who's even winning. I can't even, like, check. Um, it's bushy. Thank you. That was not a good corner. I just didn't, uh, just didn't get through the center as quickly as it would like. Hmm. We can try to be Nick, but I don't want to wreck him trying to do it either. I don't want to wreck anyone trying to get a uh, 11th place. But uh, we'll, we'll give it everything we got. Yeah, if we think we can get there, we'll try it, but... Not gonna force something that isn't meant to be. Because that's how you end up wrecking, usually. I can get my breaking point. Mm. Yeah, we're just really equal on speed with him right now. I don't even think we, uh, we'd have to wait for a mistake, maybe. The lap time was at 56.1. Or did he get a chance to get by him? <laughs> this thing's trying to kill me.
Thank you, Dustin. Yes, sir. That's not helping matters at all. Oh, uh, well, there's not much for my poor little car to give anymore. We got, uh, was that six laps to go now? Like, mine's over here. Outside. Caution, oh, my. Uh oh. Is that right? Is that what we got? Well, this is going to get crazy. <laughs> and you got a, anybody got a spare set of fires I can borrow? Gavin, what's the, uh, the setting here? Are there green-white checkers enabled? I would also like to know this. No, no green-white checkers, but I think we will pick a green here. Pete Road is now open. It's kind of rolling up with two. There's no... Mm. you got five laps to go. Well, I saved my tires, but not really for this. Yeah... I can get cash back on my extra set of tires, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> I'll send one of my guys down to your pit and double your money. <laughs> Bunch up, bud. Yeah, sorry, George. We're about running out of fuel. Uh, come up. Yeah, we can't pit now. There's, we just give up way too much track position. We would never gain it all back. So does it look like one lap? Yep. yep. Left up, 29. Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. At least it's single file restarts, and I trust a lot of the people in here that they're not going to just uh, destroy someone. Nick, that car looks pretty cool. <laughs> he can't hear you. <laughs> looks so cool, I ran a version of it myself. I just feel like I'm a copier, a copycat. <laughs> now I'm really gonna have to check for tire spin because these tires are absolutely roasted. Lender, 29, carboy. Hmm. So we might they might crash up there for the win or something. Road is closed. They're good racers, but you know they're gonna try to go for it probably. So maybe we'll get some sweats through that method. Make our way through the traffic here, I guess. It's cool seeing numbers that aren't like one through thirty or whatever. The only numbers you ever see are like car sixty-seven. Yeah, what is going on up there? Pulling the tires off. <laughs> Elite. We got the Elite Strats right there. Cooling the tires off. I think I'm the first one with fresh tires in 23rd, so y'all better watch out. <laughs> yeah, I'd give somebody a dollar to stop on the track right now. Well, I'm in 20th, I'll wave at you on your way by. I just, I didn't think I was going to make it all the way back through. Well, Maybe I was wrong. Two to go. Two to go. Race cars coming in this lap. 
But I mean, it's going to be a one lap shootout. <laughs> There's no way he's gonna. I'll, I will be so shocked if he makes his way all the way. I just feel like you're gonna get blocked too much by too many cars, you know? We'll see. We'll see. Maybe he'll zoom around the outside and win the darn thing. <laughs> Kevin, this was fun. Thanks for the host, and uh, can't wait to do it again. Get ready, going green. Yeah, thanks for coming out. It's been a fun race. <laughs> a couple more cautions more than I wanted, but it's been good. I'm going to look to probably host one just like every season or something. We'll see. Woo! Every season. That's awesome. That's cool. I'm excited for that. It's a great track. Ice car is off. Man, they went really early. Wow, we. Wow, we just had we. Car inside. White flag. Still there, inside. Go high. Clear. This thing ain't turning no more. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ah, we tried. Good one. Good race, guys. <laughs> Good race, that was fun. B12, that's it. Good win, as always. Over. Bring it back Good race, to the pit. Good race, guys. Yep, that was fun. Thank you again, Gavin. Yeah, thanks you all for coming out. That was super fun. Really, really had fun. So amazed about all of it. It's crazy. Problem. Thank you. It's all you, man. Yeah, but, uh, I want to say my piece. You gonna go? You gonna go? Thanks for hosting. It's fun, guy. Yeah, that was some great intense racing. That was a lot of fun. Uh, thanks for hosting and congrats again. <clears throat> Yeah, Eric and John, it was good running with you guys back there around 20th place. All right. Good clean racing. Thanks. I don't know if I've been able to show this Congratulations out yet. again, man. But uh, Nick's created its game. That's cool. Yeah, thanks, Frank. It was a good fight back there. Woo! So, let's uh, see what happened out there. Thanks, Gavin. That was fun. 68, 78, yeah. Yeah, thanks for coming, 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 all, woo, woo, as woo, usual. Woo. <laughs> Yeah, fun race. Thanks for hosting. Take a look Thanks at Instagram. Thanks for coming. Super fun. Really had fun. Fun, fun, fun. Race, race, race. All right. So lap two. Right. So, oh, got some blinking. Oh, Gavin self spin. Oh no. Uh, he didn't uh, damage it much though. That's too bad. That was our first caution, the first caution ever in the hosted races. Some blinking. Some blinking. Ooh, missed the breaking point there. Kind of guy gets the cut down a little bit. Oh, but then gets loose on exit. Woo! I love that scheme though, the mobile one. It's classic. Ooh, no turning. Went in a little hard, maybe. Maybe thought it was turns three and four. <laughs> Gotta take the two turns differently. Gonna have to skip when he comes up, assuming it's a uh, blinking wall. Uh, grabbed him. Darn glue walls. It's blinking. Got here. Loose on entry. Oh, no! That must have been the next caution. Ooh, that's rough. That just uh, got, that was some loose on entry, and uh, unfortunately there was a car up there. I think otherwise he would have saved it. It's 
deck's tough, though. It's it's definitely tough. Maybe somebody can explain. I don't understand these rules. How I got a uh, black flag. And, uh, that I passed under yellow. Going into the pit. Oh, he got a black flag under the Uh, that happens when you pass the guy directly in front of you going to pit road. Oh, yeah, I do remember that. Yeah. So confusing. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, when he was going on pit road, I'm like, pass the who car? Yep, no it's uh, a common penalty. Don't worry. Some more blinking. Just make sure you're behind the guy the message tells you and stay behind. Ooh. Right. Oh, those are some hard hits. That stinks. So he just, uh, he had the wall on the straight, probably looking to the left, maybe. And uh, when he got it off there, got it all crazy. He was kind enough to pull it to the right, but then slid down in front of some guys. That was some good dodging. By these guys. Woo! That could have been bigger. Got some quick reflexes I'm back up. The hard way. That's the best way. <laughs> yeah, it sure is. I'm not sure why we're seeing hit exit. going on there. Bit of wandering on the straight. Too bad though. Just a tiny wall tap. We're already 41 laps in. We have only just seen a couple incidents. Definitely nothing real bad like guys diving in on people. Kind of stuff you'd see like in a fixed race or something, an official fixed race. Caution showing up for some reason. Ooh, self spin. Same spot, I think, is right around where Gavin did it. We had some new tires around that point. Super slick. Overdrove it. Just been looking at something else. Wandered on to the right side. Anybody still there? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm just watching the incident. Yeah, I'm watching the incident too. Joe, how, when did they count that you had a uh, car under yellow? Is it when you hit the pit um, lane uh, marker for the speed limit, or is it the uh, um, start finish? Uh, I think it's when it first says approaching pit lane, or whatever that is before you hit the line. Yes, that's true. Yeah, thank you. I made it for a big reward. <laughs> yeah, it can be super tricky here because of uh, the access road. You can unintentionally pass people. That might have been what happened there. Yeah, I did. I, I picked that for different than this car. No, wait. You know, this car in the car. I saw the 36 and I thought that was... Uh, oh, well. Hmm. 77 hitting the wall. Gavin, shout out, lap. <laughs> Good group of guys, though. 74, 81 tire wear after 100 laps. 68, 78. I'm well, embarrassed, I'm not going to show up. <laughs> I was just driving as hard as I could, though. That's barely any tire wear, though. I'm very surprised. Hey, David. No, I'm so disappointed. I, I should have pitted when the leaders did around my 40 45, and I didn't because I thought there would be a lot more cautions, and I just never got one to come later. I'm kicking myself. What lap did you come in? Yeah, same thing happened to me. I, I was a. Uh... I pitted for fuel only. Uh, I forget. It was. Well, yeah, it was that 40, 45-ish right in there, that caution. Wow. I just thought there would be more tire fall-off, but, I mean, there wasn't a ton of tire fall-off, and so it just Ooh. never worked out to, to where, I don't know, I just mispredicted it. I was like, ah. 
Yeah, it sounds like you and I run the same strategy, David. I ended up with a set of tires I never used to. I thought I was going to be cool guy and, <laughs> you know, get a late caution and have the fresh tires. <laughs> well, where I got really worried was when I got fuel only and then most of the people behind me got tires and they weren't passing me super fast. And I was like, oh, no, this is not a good sign because that means that even if I do get to come, tires aren't that much of an advantage compared to what I thought, so I'm probably screwed. Mm. Yeah, I'm pretty surprised at how little the tires wore off. I mean, the 70s and 80s after 100 laps is pretty crazy. Yeah, I mean, if I had known what I knew now as far as tire wear, I definitely would have pitted with the leaders on lap, like, whatever it was, 40 or whatever. But I just thought that was too early. When I saw them putting on their tires, I was like, there's no way I'm going to use my set of tires in the first half of the race. But I guess that was the right call. I, I just... I messed that up. I just didn't think that... I just thought there'd be more wear. Yeah, same thing. Same exact thought process. Ended up in the same boat. Well, live and learn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah. <laughs> it was still fun, though. Yeah, for sure. Good race. Yeah, probably. I probably was using too much wheel throughout that whole race because it seems like my, my, my right front was... It Sorry, I'm not talking about incidents, I'm talking to, to the guys afterward. Probably a weird video at this point. That wasn't intentional, was it? We're not angry at people in the hosted race for fun, are we? I think they probably just didn't realize they were stopping there. David, 100 laps? That was good, man. Thanks. I mean, yeah, at the end there, I feel like my tires were holding fairly even with everyone else. I mean, I, I guess they probably get to a point where eventually it doesn't matter too much. All right. But, um, All right, David, I'm just going to end this video here real quick. So uh, we ended up P12. Strategy didn't quite go our way, but uh, we had some great, exciting battles and uh, lots of fun racing. And that's what it's all about. So we got Gavin, got six, Nick finished right in front of us. We had to go at him. Couldn't quite get to him. And uh, overall, very fun race. I uh, felt like I learned a lot about this track and how ARCA runs here. And I uh, hope it was entertaining to watch for you as well. I will uh, see you next time, uh, wherever and in whatever car that might be. <laughs> Thanks for watching.